depriming and priming shotgun shells in the field. I already primed these up. Here's some that was deep primed. A little wooden stick came off of a walking stick. Drilled a hole. First, I deep primed one. Stuck it in there to drill bit. Drilled through it. Didn't have a drill press because I'm out in the field. So it didn't come out straight, but it does go straight through here. That come out right to primer. All these shotgun shells are free. We got a lot of people who shoot ducks, squirrels, quail, doves, skeet. So I just pick them up free or some of them dive shot. Just stick it in there. Use a punch. Pops right out. Take a primer. Push it in part of the way. Now it becomes a priming tool. Push all the way to the bottom. It's primed. Works on that brand. Here's Remington brand. Right out the primer. Sometimes it gets stuck in there. Now for Winchester brand. Battery dead. Camera's old and doesn't hold a charge. While you're sitting at a campfire, after you've done cleaned your weapons and ate, you can start reloading some shells again. Last one. Now that I have them all done, it's time to charge them up. Pour in the powder.
battery error again. Put in power, put in your little patch. Priming tool, deep primer. Comes into a packing tool now. Now I'll put in the load. Another patch. That was 67 of them. So I got that many 33 left out of 100. Now to go to campfire, get the ceiling. That's melted wax. Just pour some wax over it, seal it up. Let it sit to dry. One load of chill. If anybody's wondering what size this is, three sixteenths. It's one of them long shaft punch. Give it Harbor Freight, you get a set of them. About twelve dollars, I think it was. Perfect size for the primer.